Hello everybody, so this will be a Final Fantasy VIII remastered playthrough of the game. Um, so essentially it's my first time ever doing this, so I'm, I, I'm not sure how to proceed, but I just thought since I like to play video games and, you know, I don't mind sharing what's going on as I play through it, hopefully this will be something of interest to you. Uh, let me know if the quality and the audio is okay. Um, essentially what I'm doing is recording it through the PS5 and then just uh, forwarding it to the YouTube link. But please let me know if there's anything I can do to make this better. So essentially it's my first time playing this. I actually played it a little bit, like 10 minutes in. But to be honest, it's been a couple of weeks since I last played it, since I was playing other games. So here we go. We'll see how the game is. Oh, sorry, I had to continue there. So new game. Uh, looks okay to me. We will. I'll try to avoid using any like the. I won't. Use, I will not skip random battles, and I won't use battle boosts. Uh, the boost speed might be something I'll be using quite a bit, just so that I can speed up the, just the moving between areas. Um, other than that, I don't plan on using the other the other options. I probably would if I were to try to get all the like the achievements and trophies in this game, just so that I don't have to. Uh, go through it in a long way, especially the, I guess, I don't know, the secret bosses, the ultimate bosses, those things are insanely hard to take down. because some of the uh, secret or the ultimate bosses over there are very, very tough, especially I believe the ruby, uh, I don't remember the exact name of the ruby boss, is the one that you have to go to the desert and it shoots out those two tentacles and attacks you. Uh, very tough. Uh, very, very tough. I didn't do it the optimal way. 
Alright, so here we'll say, Dr. Kadawaki, how are you feeling? Okay, I guess. Take it easy next time you're here. Looks like your eyes are focusing. You should be fine. Say your name for me. So I'm just going to leave it as is, Squall, uh, Squall, because I never played the game originally. So I'm just going to leave the character as his name. Why didn't you take it easy in training? Next time you might not be so lucky. Tell that to uh, Saphir. I think I'm saying it's Cypher, Saphir. That's Saphir, won't listen to anyone. Why don't you ignore him? I can't just run away. You want to be cool, huh? Well, don't get hurt in the process. Let's see your instructor is... Quiz... Oh jeez, Quiztis. Quiztis, oh gosh. I'll call her now, just wait here a minute. Quiztis, come get your student. Yes, yes. His injury is not serious. He'll probably leave a scar. Right, now please come by. Again, I played a little bit of this, not too much. Uh, sorry. Squall, so we meet again. Yeah, I didn't play much of this. I played like maybe 10, 15 minutes. Uh, so I haven't got much in. I did this part, I remember. I don't remember too much about it. It's just pretty much introductory parts. Let's just say I haven't even got to my first battle in this game, so I haven't gotten far at all in this game at all. I'm guessing this is a teacher. I knew it would be either you or Sifir. Come on, let's go. Today's the field exam. Alright. Squall, is there something on your mind? Is there? Not really, not really. Haha, <laughs> what's so funny? Funny, no, no, it's not that. I'm just happy. I feel like I'm beginning to understand my student a little, that's all. I'm more complex than you think. Then tell me. Tell me more about yourself. <laughs> it's like if I, once I stop. <laughs> certain w okay. It's none of your business? I never played the original, so I'm not sure if it's just graphically they enhance the game just so it makes it look better when playing on the PS4, or PS5. I believe the game came out on the PS1, so it's definitely a lot probably has changed in terms of the quality of life. I'm not sure if any of the gameplay changed besides like the the boost and the no nope, battle escapes. I'm not sure if that's like also in the original, but I would imagine not. Good morning, class. Let's start with today's schedule. There seems to have some serious rumors, fly some rumors flying around since yesterday. Yes, the field exam for seed or CD uh, candidates will begin later this afternoon. Those not participating and those who failed last week's written test are to remain here in the study hall. Field exam participants will have free time until the exam. Just be sure you're not you're in top condition. Me in the hall at 1600 hours. I'll announce the team's assignments there. Any questions? Oh, and Saphir? Do not injure your partner while training. Be careful from now on. I guess he's not happy. Field exam participants, I will see you all later. And Squall, I need to talk to you. This guy failed or something? So something, uh, before I continue, something about this game what I usually do is I like to talk to a lot of NPCs or I don't proceed right away throughout the game immediately, especially on my first run through of the game. Um, essentially I just want to make sure I can get some like that additional dialogue, look through different areas. Um, I feel with these type of Final Fantasy games you kind of, for more uh, information, additional armor, like the, to get the best armor too, you need to make sure you can go through these little additional steps. Especially when you beat the game, I assume there's other additional uh, content that you need to pursue when you want to complete the whole 
game. Like, it's 100% essentially. So let's see what she says. Uh, you better show some courtesy to Instructor Trippy. Sure. It's an honor to be called over by Instructor Trippy. Yep. Try to smile a little when you're talking to the Instructor. Okay. You haven't been to the fire cavern yet, have you? You won't be able to take part in today's seat exam if you don't pass the pre this prerequisite. I was going to do this morning, but Saphir... Hmm. Do you have a good excuse? Not really. Then let's get going. If you're not too confident yet, you can review your studies at the study panel. I'll be waiting at the front gate, so come down when you're ready. You can access the study panel from your seat. Alright, thank you. Check it out. I'm assuming that she's referring to the seat here. Or am I crazy? No. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see. Turn on power and what a pain. Turn on power. Oh gosh. Uh, I guess tutorial here. Login, squall, confirm, GF data from squall searching. Squall. Okay. Shiva and Ku is a cot. Shiva. The heck? Unlock Guardian Force Cliff. Okay, that was easy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This tutorial covers all aspects of the gameplay. This tutorial can also be accessed through the regular menu at any time during the game. Oh my. Okay. Uh, so it's your typical JRPG uh, format with these type of games, essentially. You know, you have the HP, the ATB ga uh, gauge, which is just essentially um, when it's ever full, it's your turn to make a move. Uh, magic, GF, I'm not sure what GF stands for. Magic is simple. Okay, so they don't even go through GF yet here. Okay, so item, simple, GF. GF is a su summons a GF. Okay, so this is your summoning, your summoner. Perfect. And draw extracts magic enemies. Choose a target and magic. Choose a target and magic and then stock or cast. Stock will stock the magic and cast will cast the magic. Interesting. The new command is more powerful than the usual. Okay, interesting. This is a limit break. We'll choose your target from a window to escape. Okay, so as long as I damage enemies, I actually get some experience from that. That's interesting. Like, uh, that's very new, you know? Junction enables characters to power up and use abilities. This means... A GF must be junctioned in order to power up and use abilities. Let's begin by junctioning a GF. Right now. No GF is junctioned. Okay. All other commands in grade cannot be selected yet. When searching is selected, okay. The GF magic command appears. Since the GF is junction, the magic is displayed in gray. This is junction and GF. I select the GF. The GF list appears. Press uh, square to see abilities possessed by a GF. The, the abilities are GP, junction, vitality, junction, etc. Let's choose a GF. When GF quiz. Quiz set quit. Okay. Well, let's just start. I can just mention this quiz. Its abilities: JP, J, and Fight J. Make the stats JP and Fit appear in white. Magic can now be junctioned to HP and Fit. Uh, but since there is no currently no magic, we will move on to setting abilities. There are three command abilities and two non-command abilities for characters and party. Okay. A total of five abilities can be set. Depending on the GF's ability, the maximum is four non-combat, com sorry, non-command abilities. This means that up to seven abilities can be set. Let's set some abilities. First, let a slot. The top window is your command abilities used during battle. The bottom is your non-combat. Okay, the bottom window is for character and party abilities. Select the top window that displays command abilities. Yep. And then selecting the bottom window displays character and party abilities. Select 
since there's currently no magic, let's set the command ability draw to get some magic. When the NFT slot is chosen, the cursor moves to the right. Select draw to set the command draw. This is how commands abilities used during battles are set. Let's add GF and item to the list of command abilities. Now GF and item are set. Let's set a non-command ability, but move the cursor down. Character ability is displayed. Now to set magic plus 20%, select an NT slot and select magic 20%. It's now set. Abilities haven't been set. This concludes the tutorial. Thank you and good luck. Gosh. So I'm not gonna lie, this is quite a bit to get into, so I won't, you know, go through all of it maybe. I will maybe I should. Okay, I'll go through this. I thought this was gonna also be the same way. So the cards originated from okay. Picture and numbers correspond to the four sides to the card. One is weak for uh, A is strong. Okay, so we'll look at top left three, seventy-five and two. Elements. Some of the element allow the player to use its elements properly. Okay. Property. Battle area. The place cards here once and one at a time. Elemental use rules indicate elements on the board. Cards are placed in turn, and the player with the most cards when all nine areas are filled wins. Okay. Choose five cards before you begin play. Att pay attention to numbers, elements, card name, number, and stock page number, and chosen card. Same turns over cards have the same number values or on two or more sides. So let's see, in this example, numbers four and one are adjacent to top and left sides. Okay, I see what I mean. This turns over the top and left cards, yep. Plus means that cards adding to the same number on more than two adjacent sides are turned over. In this example, the cards place add up to seven. Yeah, five plus two, fine, I see it. On the top and left side. Or four plus three, yeah. I'll look at the wrong side. The cards on top and left are turned over. Okay. So cards turn over using same or plus turn over adjacent cards in combo. In this example, red will be turned over because one of the two cards turned over is a larger number. Yeah. So three is a larger number than two. So it'll be turned over. Interesting. Same wall uses battle area wall at the frame. As one of cards no four sides when using same rule. Wall is assumed to have a value of all sides. Okay. Elemental changes the number of value of the card depending on the elemental property. When a card is slot match elemental properties, the number value increases by one. If elements don't match, the card loses one from the original number value. So open all cards face up, random cards chosen at random, set of death, play until someone wins. Cards are traded when the game is over, when the winner takes one card from the loser in the basic trade rule one. There are many trade rules besides one, pay attention to the trade rule before you begin a match. Or begin a game, sorry. Direct take cards you turn over, but lose cards turn over by the opponent. Diff, winner takes a number of cards by which he or she won. All the winner takes all the cards from the loser. Interesting. Icon explanations. Okay. I fire, ice, thunder, earth, poison, wind, water, holy. Okay. So typical JRPG. These type of games. Um, it'll take some time to remember all of them. Some of them are more easy to understand than others. So I'm not going to worry about that for now, because I think this is just a lot of just basic elements that we've went through in the game, and I'm sure over time when you're playing these type of games, you start to understand more and more as you continue. Uh, the basics. Refer to the tutorial. Yeah, okay, I'm going to... I'm going <laughs> to... I think I'm going to stop for now doing this, because I'm pretty sure it'll take a long time, and I don't want to overdo it for this. Picture this page, but there won't be any updates for a while, but that's because I, the Garden Festival Chair, will be leaving Garden. I do not strive to be this a seed, and I won't even graduate. I divide all my time to the Garden Festival with my passion. But in the end, there's no uh, Garden Festival, there's no cause. That's because no one volunteered to help out, but I have only blamed myself. I thought I could pull it off alone. I'll be starting a new life, but I sincerely hope someone will take over the Garden Festival Committee. Goodbye, Balam Garden. Only don't worry. Okay. 
opinions are important, but my favorite place to write down the place most in Triple I got first, Trippy's forever baby. Man, I wanna go out with her. She'll be creepy. You gotta name the mass, I'm gonna kick your ass. What's your name? Oh I'm so scared, I'm so scared, big loser. I should kick both of your sorry asses. This is enough for your silly games, got it? Shoot. I don't want the disciplinary committee to get in my case, so I'm writing my name, J.I. Who's... Wait, who's J.I.? Who are you? Oh, let me see. See, there's no nosy. Good thing I want by initials. I'll go by initials too. Hey, does anyone know if I can get new hot dogs for good? I haven't tried them yet. Oh yeah, they're the best, man. You're missing out on a mess. Damn, I missed it. Hey, Z, have your exams today? Great, good luck, man. Hope you do well in your exams. Be careful, alright? Sorry, I'm just getting a quick water here. Sorry about that. Okay, I'm, I'm good here. I don't want to continue doing this. Uh, okay, I can't back out, apparently. Okay, uh, there you go. I'm done for now. I'll, I can go back to this, I'm assuming, um, through the menu or by any other means. Especially in the beginning, I highly doubt they'll let you just do that and then you can't go back to it in some other way. So I have gone through this part before, so I know what's gonna happen. I'm late, I'm late, I'm late! Wow. I'm gonna be a nice guy in this playthrough. There. Teehee, I'm fine. Sorry, I was going in a hurry. Oh yeah, hey, did you just come from the cl that class? Is homeroom over? Whoa, oh no. This place is so much bigger than my last garden. Oh hey, hey. I just transferred here. Do you think you can give me a quick tour of this garden? As I said, I'm gonna be a nice guy. Sure. Woohoo! Alright, let's go. I'll take the elevator to the first floor lobby and I'll show you the directory. So again, like in these type of games, I like to go around first. I'm sure this is the way I have to go, since I believe that was the... Well, that was the um, elevator. These people just jump out of nowhere. Maybe they're still connected to the final exams today. I'll have to try it even harder. Wonder how many will pass. So the failure rate is quite high. Okay. So I'm just moving up to them. I'm not even talking to them. I'm not pressing any other buttons, action buttons. I guess that window was too quick. I have to be in the next very precise spot for them to engage in that conversation. Yo, squad instructor Treppy always headed for the front gate. So I'm gonna go here. I guess there's something there. So yeah, I I don't know these type of games. I kind of really enjoy. Um, never again played it when I was a when I was a kid. I never owned a PS1. And these type of games um, were made for the PS1. Oh hey, would you like to have these? My brother gave them these cards. Gave me these cards, but they are really not my thing. You can have them if you like. Hey, what do you? How do you play a card game? Hmm, I don't think it would be best to look at the conversation in the tutorial. I don't know much about it really. If you want to play guard games with someone, try to, to talk to them by pressing square. But keep in mind, not everyone is a card player. Oh, and by the way, I don't play, so don't bother challenging me. Hey, you have that seat exam today. You still have to go to the oh, right, should we take it easy? Yeah, I'm well, confident as always. So, triangle. Okay, so triangle does show you, like, basically everything. So, the junction and. Let me see if I can set this up because apparently now I can do it myself. So I go here, magic. Yes. Gosh. I feel like these games, like, you need to get used to it eventually because I know that for myself, like, I'm not. I'm not really used to these type of things. Like, I, I feel like. I need to just play the game without having to worry too much about what's going on. So I'm just going to put some abilities and should be good to go, I think, like that. So I'm level 7 already. I wonder if it's going to continue by with that. Um, just curious, can you save these games? Okay, so you can't save there. Okay, so let's move forward. check something actually. Sorry, I, I hope you're very shocked if I was doing all this and then my, okay, um, my course are set. Okay, we're good. Alright, so we're 4 1. We've moved up a little bit. Let's see what's going on. That's the directory. 
I did this part as well, actually. Now I remember a little bit. This was like the last part I did. Well, this is it. Balam Garden is pretty big. It's a good idea to check where you want to go and select it here. I have a question. How do you use this? Move the cursor and press X. To select, sorry. Next, I'll give a quick explanation on the various facilities. Yes, sir. You'll find the dormitory to the north. The majority of the students live in the dorms. There aren't too many students who commute. Yeah, I'm in the dorms too. You can rest and change in there. West of the north block is the cafeteria. There's always a big rush for the hot dogs. You better get used to waiting in line. Got it. East is the north block. East of the north block is the parking lot. Usually, we usually take the garden car when a mission comes up. The front gate is located in the south. That's right, I have to go meet instructor Trepe at the front gate. Hmm, what's the matter? Nothing. Next, we have the quad, located in the west block. There's a big, there's, there's an event being planned there. I know, I know, it's the garden festival. I'm going, it's going to be great, I'm planning to be on the committee. You want to help out too? <laughs> Doesn't even answer. Let's just continue. South of the west block is the infirmary. This is where you can get treated for your injuries, but a lot of students just come here for advice. That's the doctor, what's the doctor's name? Dr. Kadawaka. Now the east block. This is the training center, it's only open, only facility open at night. It's used for training and they have real monsters running loose there. If you don't take it seriously, you may end up dead. Just be careful. Cool. Okay. South of the east block is the library. There's a lot of materials you can look up here, but the terminals in the classroom are a lot more efficient. And you already know about the classroom on the second floor, right? Yep, I remember that one. By the way, the headmaster's office is located on the third floor if you need, pres you need permission to get in. Another question, what's the headmaster's name? Headmaster Sid. That's about it. Anything else? Got it. Cool. Hey, um, are you taking the C exam? Yeah. Then maybe I'll see you again later. I've already finished my training in my previous garden. I'll be taking the C exam today too. Good luck to both of us, huh? Thanks a lot. See ya. Bye. You wanna talk to me after that? Okay. Oh gosh, I thought I got stuck for a second. I'm assuming this is a, yeah, save point, access the menu, and select save three data. It's the same kind of uh, format as um, like Final Fantasy VII, and uh, I believe Final Fantasy IX does this. You can't just save in Google to save, so we'll save. Okay, awesome. All right, so this is gonna be where I'm gonna stop now because I'm not sure how long I want to keep these videos at. I'm thinking between like you know 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Around there, I definitely don't want to go over 40 minutes if I have to. Like these type of games are long, I would assume, but I don't want to, you know, make sure they prolonged sitting there too long for one video. I feel like sometimes people get, for myself, I like to watch those videos, but sometimes I just can't sit there for 30 minutes straight unless I pause and you know take a break, for example, do some of the things. But hope you guys enjoy. Let me know if this is okay quality. And let me know if this is of interest. Again, I'm just doing this like a hobby, something in the background. I won't be like pumping up videos every day, but I will be, you know, trying to do this uh, weekly, put some videos out during the week. Um, but I'll probably do most of my gameplay during the weekend. And again, during the week, I'll just make sure I put up some videos. Again, I'm not even sure if this will be a thing. It's just something of interest. I thought about it. And sometimes when you think about doing something, you just, why not? Just do it. You never know. It won't hurt if you don't try. All right. Thank you everyone for watching, and uh, have yourselves a great day. Bye.